hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com My name is Jason Newland and this is Relax and Sleep Hypnosis Daily Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes And if you would like to support this free service please go to paypal.me forward slash Jason Newland Thank you very much. Now, I thought it well, was a bit my my voice a little weird there. I thought it would be nice to do some affirmations. And for those that, well, firstly, don't know what affirmations are, it can seem a little bit. Uh, Icky wicky, um, kind of tree huggy, uh, tantricky, kind of mm, mystical, um, but it's not really. It's just saying something that's true to yourself, either out loud. Um, so quite a lot of affirmations would be out loud if you're on your own but not if you're around other people firstly because well in the western society I don't know about other societies but uh, generally standing there repeating a, a certain phrase outside of a religious setting wouldn't be deemed acceptable Secondly, it's personal to you. So, you know, it's no one else's business what you're doing or what affirmations or sentences that you are repeating. So there's a few reasons why uh, it may work. I say may just there's different beliefs around it. It does work. Um, there's a few reasons why or how it works. One of the reasons is we get what we focus on. We get more of what we focus on. You get what you think about most of the time. So whatever you're thinking about a lot of the time, that's what your unconscious mind is going to try and give you. Okay. So for someone that's focused all the time on their pain, then the unconscious mind is going to give them more pain. Not as a punishment, not for any negative reason other than that's what the unconscious mind thinks that that person wants it's because they're focusing on it so the unconscious mind is guided by what you focus on it tries to give you more of that it's a very, I guess in a way, it's a very simplistic communication. Yet it's very easy, in a sense. And sometimes the, the easiest ways to communicate are the strongest ways. more very strict ways of communicating so there's no doubt about what it means yet we didn't realize that perhaps that the unconscious mind takes very seriously what we think about 
and tries to give us more of it. And sometimes that way of giving it to us is by our unconscious behavior. Which may not be useful. So by focusing on what we do want, our unconscious mind, our brain, our body, all the cells in our existence pretty much works to give us that. Especially the more you focus on those things or that thing. So in a way that's how affirmations, it's a long winded way, affirmations work. Other benefits of affirmations, especially if you're going to do them for any, you know, if you're going to do them for a while, as in like spending 10 minutes doing it, which is not what I'm recommending, although that would probably do yeah, it may be more beneficial, but not everybody has the tolerance to sit there and to speak out some sentences over and over again for 10 minutes, because then you're in the territory of chanting. And my background is in Buddhism, chanting something I know a little bit about. I'm not an expert on anything, but I've done, I've done, I've done some chanting. And part of the benefit of chanting, because it's almost a way of meditating. So you can chant walking around uh, and you can chant. And it puts you into a meditative state. And one of the main reasons for that, some would say it's because of a spiritual connection. But from a practical perspective, it's because you're focusing on what you're chanting. You're focusing on that. Now, with chanting, it's more musical, uh, although some are kind of very kind of bland. I don't know what that me, 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 that's Kermit the Frog chanting. But if you say these things to yourself or out loud, whilst you're doing it, you're not thinking about anything else. You're not focusing on anything else. You're not thinking about something that happened yesterday. You're not thinking about what you're going to have for dinner. You're not thinking about negative thoughts. You're not thinking about what you haven't got. You're focusing on the words that you say the sentence that you're saying. You're focusing on that. So there's multiple benefits. Because. If you were. For example. To sit down. And decide to do this for 10 minutes. That's 10 minutes. Of a complete break. From thinking. Because you're not thinking when you're saying this stuff. Not really. It's not You're not focusing on any thoughts in your mind. Whilst you're reading out. I say reading out. You might have it on a piece of paper to read out. Or you might just say it. Something for example like. Relaxing is easy for me. 
or I relax easily. Okay? So that sentence, I relax easily. It doesn't take any th really thinking to say it. But while you're saying it, You're not, you're not thinking about anything else. You're not focusing on anything else. You're giving it your full attention. And you may, th you might as well think of it in a way, when you're saying this, you're talking to your unconscious mind. And saying it a couple of times, Your unconscious mind might not really notice, but your conscious mind will. Now, consciously, in this moment, in the now, you can actually start to feel better. You can start to feel happier. You can start to feel lighter by repeating positive sentences to yourself. So short term, consciously, you're going to feel happier and better, more relaxed and affected by whatever the words are that you're saying. So if you keep repeating the words, I am very intelligent. Or I am super intelligent. Or I'm happy. Or it could be When I smile, my body heals. You know, and you might say it a couple of times, it might feel nice. Say it a few more times, a few more times, and a few more times, and your conscious mind starts to really. I guess. Because that's what the conscious mind is focusing on. Those negative thoughts that are waiting to be listened to. Because they love, they love your attention. They get overshadowed. By these positive thoughts. These positive affirmations. Take over your conscious mind and that affects how you feel now in the moment and at the same time your unconscious mind is absorbing these messages and as you step back it's almost like a picture. So there's you. There's your unconscious mind inside you. There's your conscious mind. And I point to the brain for that, even though no one knows where the where the mind is. But we focus on the brain. And then there's you, the body. You're the one reading out these sentences of positivity. Such as, I am kind.
I am kind. I am beautiful. I am beautiful as I am. I am beautiful as I am. So you've got that being said. Your conscious mind is listening. Because you're consciously doing it. So your conscious mind is actively involved in the process of you reading this out. So the conscious mind has to be involved, has to be affected. It can't not be. And because you're reading this out consciously, all of your conscious attention is going towards the words that you are reading out in your affirmation. And then you've got your unconscious mind that's listening, that's absorbing what you are saying. Noticing what you're focusing on. And you know what happens in that moment? Synchronicity. Your conscious mind and your unconscious mind are synced together because they're both doing exactly the same thing. Which means that that message moves much quicker into your unconscious mind. The message of what you want more of. The message of what you will have more of. Because your unconscious mind will make sure of that. Because that's what it does. But it's almost fast tracked. So you're consciously starting to feel the benefits of repeating these affirmations. But because your conscious mind and your unconscious mind is synced, it's connected together in this moment. The power of that is incredible. That is a life changing scenario, depending on what you're thinking depending on what your affirmation is. But that synchronicity gives you an opportunity to request, to request what you want. That, in some one sense, is the most purest form of hypnosis that there could be because although it doesn't feel perhaps how you would expect hypnosis to feel you don't need to be unconscious or well not unconscious but you don't need to have your eyes closed you don't even need to feel relaxed for that to be beneficial that synchronicity between your conscious mind and your unconscious mind, that flow, that connection, gives you the opportunity to ask for what you want. For 
for example, I want to be free from cigarettes. I am free. So you can pay, you can word it in a positive as if it's already happened. I am now a non smoker. I relax really easily. And you can feel that emotion underneath that. There's emotion there. This isn't just. I can relax really easily just saying the words. You mean this. We're not messing around here. This is serious. You mean when you say that you are now a non-smoker. You mean that. When you say that from now on, you can relax yourself completely whenever you choose. And you say that with conviction, with energy. You mean it. So your conscious mind and your unconscious mind believe what you're saying. And take you seriously. And in turn. Reward you. By giving you. What you want. Because. You're working. Everything's working together. Within you. Flowing. Easily. And naturally. How it should. The system is working how it was supposed to work. Everything in sync with each other. Working to help you. All parts of you working to help you. So this gives you possibilities that are probably much bigger than this recording will cover. Because at the moment we're just focusing on affirmations connected with relaxing and sleeping. But as you can now see possibilities really are amazing for what you can do for yourself to change your life in a positive way So now, let's do some affirmations. Let's focus on relaxing to start with. And what I'll do is, I'll do it ten times. Now, I'm going to give you some affirmations to say out loud or you can say it to yourself of course up to you now you can re-listen to this recording every day for 30 days if you really really want to absorb its message like really absorb that powerful message of this recording. Listen for 30 days. And when I say listen for 30 days, I don't mean non stop because that would be ridiculous. <laughs> I mean once a day for 30.
30 days. Now, 10 times I'm going to say the affirmation. I now relax easily. Okay. I'd like you to repeat after me. I'll say it. I'll leave a gap. And then I'll say the next one, which will be the same sentence. Okay. So first affirmation. I now relax easy. Or I relax easily. Is that a good sentence? That's okay. Relaxing is easy. Yeah, let's do that one. That sounds a bit better. So, and it's it's a very more simple. So, relaxing is easy. Relaxing is easy. Okay. So this I'm going to do it ten times with a gap between each one for you to repeat. Relaxing is easy. 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 Relaxing is easy.
I'd like you to do is choose some affirmations and maybe make them very simple to start with just a few words for example I fall asleep easily I know it's very similar to the, the one we just did but I sleep easily I love sleeping sleeping comes naturally sleeping is simple and you can play around with these affirmations trying out different ones maybe to do with relaxing maybe to do with sleeping perhaps nothing to do with those things just something that you want more of in your life remembering to always state things in the positive so you don't say what you don't want always say what you do want I'm going to leave you to just play around with these ideas have fun be happy so think of another affirmation and say it ten times